Hi everyone, nice to meet you again. I'm Angel. I'm so happy that I, I won the last episode. So uh, today I'm very excited to shoot with uh, some new great photographers and uh, I have been looking at their por portfolios. They are wonderful and I'm very excited to take this challenge again. Today I'm still going to use my Canon 5D Mark IV but I'm going to change my lens. I will use 24 70 mm f2.8 lens. So I think this is a great lens. You can get either close up or wide angle. Stay tuned and uh, please subscribe Photo Boxer channel and follow all our social media platforms. Hello everyone, my name is Jenny Agudelo and I am a model. I am from Colombia and I've been modeling for four years and a half. Two years and a half in Colombia and one year and a half here in Canada. In Colombia, I started modeling in a school where they teach me how to pose and how to walk in the runways. Then I signed up with an agency. I had the opportunity to be in fashion shows, work as a print model and doing commercial commercial videos. Uh, then I moved to Canada about a year and two months and designers start to contact me uh, by Facebook or Instagram. Honestly it wasn't in my plans to be a model here in Canada but uh, I had the opportunity to do that. So here I've been in fashion shows such as Star Fashion Week Toronto, uh, Durham Filipino Fest, uh, Runaway Canada, uh, Maison de Couture, uh, Raw Artists Toronto, among others. I also had the opportunity to work for internationalists and local designers as well. One of them, Susie Kijules, among others. And I also had the opportunity to be uh, published in magazines such as Elegant Magazine, Dreamy Magazine, uh, Condé Nast, uh, Tatler Magazine, uh, Beast Fashion Magazine, among others. Um, I also uh, had the opportunity here to be the model for clothing lines and I'm so excited for being in Photo Boxers episode number 3. Please follow my Instagram and don't forget to follow Photo Boxers. Hello everyone, I'm so excited today. We have Photo Boxers in the house. Um, we are doing a new theme today. I am Susie Tomasi, a fashion stylist and co uh, company owner of Susie Q Jewels, and which is a women's fashion line that empowers women with fashion. Um, I'm so excited because I am the wardrobe stylist for the third episode, which is a vintage vibe and the five different uh, styles would be vintage bridal, vintage uh, pinup style, uh, vintage glam, vintage flare and a vintage Hollywood. Hi, um, I'm Ashley Jung. I am a makeup artist. I'm three times certified. I went to CMU Julia Dantas class and professional school of makeup. I have been published multiple times at Femme Fatale, and the Magazine, Goji, um, Biz and Fashion. I'm a huge supporter of my models. I, I've been in the bad side of the business and I've been in the good, so I always try to make sure my models are having the best time they can. Um, I've been doing this for about four or five years now. Um, 
in. I've done runway shows like um, Divas in Durham runway show. I've helped with a submission to New York Fashion Week and Toronto Fashion Week. Um, yeah, uh, you can follow me down on the link and check out photo boxers for sure. So today's challenge extra condition is that you know you're gonna finally gonna submit five photos. So all these five photos are gonna be shot in different angles or the different size of the model. It's a it's gonna be uh, better for the all the results and the, for the photo boxer submission. I'm gonna pick up the first one, guys. Each one has a different style. Second one. Oh. How do you feel today? Oops. This session? <laughs> today, you guys see I'm using this uh, Godex Flash. Actually, it's a uh, now it's really challenge for me because they are gonna adjust the light and the fixed angle and uh, do everything like possibly to get as much pos uh, photos as I can. But yeah, I made it. Yeah. How do you like the today's theme? Yeah, I like it. I like I like vintage. Vintage. Yeah. Have you ever shoot a lot of this kind of scene? Not too much, but uh, yeah, I do like it. Yeah. Okay. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck to other photographers. Hey guys, my name is Jarek Tamayo. I'm going to be one of the contestants for Photo Boxers. Um, you're going to be able to follow me on Instagram at Jarek Tamayo. Um, I'm going to be using the Panasonic Lumix G9. It's a micro four thirds camera. And I'm also going to be using the prime lenses from Olympus, the F1.2 25mm, 45mm as well. And I'm also going to be using the 75mm F1.8. Alright, so please subscribe to Photo Boxers to uh, get more information on the contest. And I hope to see you guys soon.
Good, good. Yes. Eric, how do you feel today's session? Um, so that was pretty fun shooting uh, Jenny all across uh, the park over here. And I was actually running around uh, towards my backpack because I was always changing lenses. So as I mentioned before, I was using the prime lenses from Olympus. The one that I have here is a 45mm which is equivalent to 90mm. And then I was, I was also shooting with the 25mm which is equivalent to 50mm, the uh, Nifty 50. Uh, also for the wide angle lens, I was using the uh, 17mm which is equivalent to 35mm. And I was also shooting the 75mm which is equivalent to 150 So that thing is going to be able to give you more of a bokeh and that's actually really good if you have a micro four third system because if you're missing out on the uh, bokeh quality compared to a full frame um, 75 mil would be really great for that uh, how do you feel today's steam and uh, the time is tighten for you um 20 minutes yeah the 20 minutes was actually like really really fast mm -hmm. so i had to be on the go all the time but luckily throughout the summertime i was shooting a lot of people so i got used to that um, so the thing is that like whenever you're shooting for 20 minutes, you have to prepare in advance in order to get the framing, the compositions and perspectives pr uh, properly. Um, otherwise, you're just going to be like wasting a lot of time. So that's a little tip. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the model is okay? Oh yeah, she's beautiful. Okay. Thank mm -hmm. you. No problem. Okay. Thanks. Good luck. Thanks. Okay. And make sure to follow um, Photo Boxers on Instagram, also on YouTube and on uh, Facebook as well. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. <laughs>
Joshua Lund. Uh, I'm a portrait photographer. I do some family stuff and some maternity stuff, newborns. Um, today I'm going to be using my D800 Nikon with my 85mm 1.8. Um, I'm going to try to bring some mood and some funniness to this episode. I'm also going to try and win the $10,000 grand prize. Uh, please like and subscribe to Photo Boxers on YouTube. That part of my time? She's locked in. <laughs> That's it? Yeah. Oh, you, you get two more minutes if you want. Okay. <laughs> I, uh, I like to work fast. I like to be efficient. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All you use is just the natural light. You didn't use any flash or something. Yeah, no flash, no, no reflectors, no diffusers, no nothing. Just whatever the world gives me. Yeah, the model was amazing. Jenny's, uh, she's great. She's very easy to work with. A uh, great free proser, which is nice because you don't really have to coach her that much. Mm -hmm. uh, the theme was pretty neat. It's something I haven't done before, so yeah. Okay, good luck. Thank you. Hi, I'm Alnor. I'm happy to be invited today to the Photoboxes uh, event. Um, I'm a fashion, beauty, events and uh, portrait uh, photographer based out of uh, Tor downtown Toronto. Today I'm using a Nikon camera, a D850, uh, with an unusual lens. I brought along a Tamron 35 to 150 lens. Um, uh, the reason I brought that lens along is I didn't want to carry two lenses today because we'll be shooting quite fast. Uh, the challenge for me today is going to be shooting with uh, ambient light. I'm very much a studio photographer so yeah. I tend to work um, with uh, anywhere between two to five uh, strobes. So as the daylight changes uh, I'll be constantly looking for good light. Um, thrilled to be here, looking forward to today's event. If you're enjoying uh, this behind the scenes, do follow social uh, on social media photo boxes. Thank you.
What's up? <laughs> Feel today's session. Oh, it's pretty, pretty intense. Uh, I think uh, my biggest worry was would I be able to do five to six distinct uh, looks within uh, the 20 minutes, but uh, I think I paced myself well, so that part of it worked out uh, okay. So I almost felt uh, I was done in uh, 15 minutes. I think the one challenge was we did lose light, so I had to kind of uh, look for light. Uh, personally, I'm a studio photographer, so I work with um, two to five lights, and uh, so that often is a, a, a great luxury for me in terms of doesn't matter what time, right? But uh, today, I think uh, uh, being the sun having been uh, set already when I got going, uh, I was chasing the light a bit, so I had to uh, sort of think quickly in that sense. But okay. uh, yeah, it was really intense, uh, very enjoyable, and I'd like to extend my thanks to Photoboxes for uh, inviting me and including me at this uh, event. You're welcome. Thank you so much for joining us. Good luck. Thank you. We ended up doing a vintage Hollywood at the end. Check out Jenny and please follow uh, Photo Boxers episode three. Um, I am so delighted to be part of it and they did an amazing job featuring five different photographers and five different styles for vintage flair. Which, look out for it and check out the wardrobe. Please follow suzyqjewels.com. Thank you. Well, firstly, uh, I feel so excited for being part of this amazing episode. Mm -hmm. uh, honestly, all of the photographers were amazing. And thank you, thank you very much for having me. And I want to say thank you to Susie and Ashley as well, and all the team.